What about you, Stats, man? I mean, because you've been at it. Like, yeah. you know, there's some people I feel, and I always say this, you know, there's some people who are born with the music talent, you know, yeah. that itch. There's yeah. some people kind of, I feel like, Chokes and I who just worked at it to yeah, get right, better right, and right. put in some time and effort and right. was like, I'm going to rehearse my motherfucking lines till this song <laughs> come out. Yeah. But you've always been the cat, I feel, who kind of naturally was gifted. You had yeah, the you one with the keyboard with you? <laughs> 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 I won't even lie. Yeah, I mean, not speak, speak on that. Yeah, this kid yeah. had a keyboard when he was yeah, pulled pretty out. much, man. I mean, my my pops was a was a crazy musician, crazy musician, and it just ran in the family, man. Of course, back to the uh, the church days, of course. And I actually, honestly, I started out on the drums. That was my first instrument when I was like five or six. Nice. Yeah, and crazy. started doing that whole thing. And uh, I mean, I really got into the music thing, number one, because it was always around. And then number two, you know, I had a, a pastor for a dad, so I couldn't do anything else. Yeah, so, yeah. you know, all like, look, yeah. puto, you're going to yeah. do the keyboard. You're going to do the drums, the keyboard, to yeah. get the fuck out of my house. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm the pastor, you're my kid. Right. You're playing some yeah. instrument. So in everybody right. was doing their thing. And uh, I'm in the basement, like, messing with keyboards and beats. And, like, he had me early. Like, we would do, like, wedding soundtracks, different things like that. So that's yes. how I learned how to make beats because they didn't want to pay the money to get the actual soundtrack. So we would recreate the soundtrack. Yeah. Nice. Right. It was right. crazy. A remix cover. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. I didn't know that. Exactly. Hey, that's crazy. I, I, like I said, I've known this guy 10 years. I don't even know that <laughs> yeah. shit. So that's why the today's show is real right. important, real right. special. I really want to bring the people a whole different angle because yeah. I think a lot of the focus... Uh, it definitely is applied to the music because it's all about the music, but nobody ever really gets to hear right. the part about all the work, all exactly. the years, oh, all the yeah. time. Yeah. You know, you yeah. growing up just in a, it pretty much was forced in the band, the Michael yeah. Jackson. Yeah. 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 Exactly, and it's crazy because you know at that time you're looking at all your homies and they like doing their thing in school dances and all of that, and I'm at the crib like this is unfair. <laughs> and then I look at it now and and, and they just right. falling off the map, and I'm I'm blessed to do this. Like what? I see it all, it all works out. And so Dad had I wouldn't, yeah, I wouldn't trade. Stats looking out the window like, hey, uh, see that going? <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah, no, can I go to the high school, yeah. homecoming, and yeah, dance with girls? Real so tight. Like, wait, go yeah. get the fucking computer, go get the fucking keyboard, dry no. home that for about an no, hour. Right. No, no, I didn't go to a school dance real talk until senior year, like the last yeah. tour. The last two they let me and go. And that one was a fight. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, you gotta I had some money I saved back in the I made it, God, like, yo, y'all ain't gotta give me no money. Yeah. 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 He looks at his paws like, hey, man, senior year. Uh, 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 senior year. Uh, senior year. Uh, All I do is jerk off in the song. Come on, man. Let me come on. I gotta thank uh, oh, I gotta Everybody, all my production party. Like, as a matter of fact, yo, the Stone Kings probably for sure, and, and Top Squad for sure. Nice. Then I saved all that money up <laughs> that they was getting from beats. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was prob, yo. I was like, yo, I made a couple beats, be good. But we've had this talk about your work and what you put in and yeah, what you've done for a lot of people. It so it, it, it's only fair. It's only yeah. fair that you, that that you get that out of that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you yeah. put in a lot of work. Homie. Yeah. That's it. It's a blessing, man. Like I said, yeah. I, and I love to do it. You know what I'm saying? It's like it's never, you know, like like what y'all do. It's never a job, really, when you love to do it so yeah. you know you wake up in the morning like man like it's such a blessing like I, I go it to is. the studio and that's my nine to five you know what I mean like I go to the studio and, and, and work and support my family like I, I you can't ask for more you know but really honestly it started really working with these cats I, I mean you know once the Stone Kings jumped off and different ones you gotta remember I was like 15 or 16 when yep, I started yep. producing for these cats I seen the picture yeah <laughs> Time, these are the dudes, yes, you know what I'm saying? Them bona fide different ones, those are the guys. Yeah, yeah. And I'm a young kid getting into the game, so I'm like, I'm like feeling like the man, like, yo, man, I just met with jokes right now, man. This nigga just Big came in. Big hard and everything. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but nah, it was, it was like that, man. And so they they made me want to do work because I was always a young cat, so I had to I had to prove that I, I was right. sticking up as like a sore thumb. So when they was in the whips and they was in the cars, they made me want to work harder. So I was like, yo, I got to yo. get this right now. I can't wait till I'm older. I got to do it right now. So, you know, I've been for, uh, you know, blessed and, and fortunate enough to really go ahead and make those moves. So, good. it just good. works that good. way. And, and you're here in your first exclusive. I'm not sure if I'm I don't know if they talked about that shit last night. <laughs> But I do want to say this. I do want to say this. That StudioLeak.com and Black Certified Radio are the first to bring it to you. Oh, That's all right. Hello. That's all I'm saying. Hey, shout out to everybody.
everybody fucking doing their thing. Yeah, we, we don't hate. Hey, brother, one we're day. We're just going to work hard and show everybody what right. time it is. That's, that's all it. we got to do. That's what now, it is. Now, so go on back. Uh, you know, and talk about all the uh, the time and the energy. Yeah. Let's talk about the money. You oh, gotta put money in something. You gotta I've seen Steph yourself. Studio, man. The fucker has it all. Uh, uh, <laughs> Real it, talk. It, it takes Bunch the of money nice to pictures make the money. and yeah, fucking yeah. It, it everything. He has posters of some artists I didn't even know existed. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Because in that in that studio, like. You know, you gotta branch out too, and yeah. I, and I wanted I wanted a country artist to be able to walk in the studio and feel comfortable. I wanted a rock artist to come. I wanted a nice. hip hop artist. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. I didn't. I, you know, you're not gonna have a classical artist come in. I walk in there, I get on the wall, yeah. and like, yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Walk yeah. 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 empty. Yeah. Yeah. You ain't gonna. Have it seems like everybody that walks in there walks out with a fucking hook. Except <laughs> fucking tech. What the oh, fuck? Yeah. You know what? No, me and Tech had a dope ass conversation last time he was in the studio. That shit. I mean, I, I took that shit to heart, and a lot of records I re. Recorded after we had a conversation. You know, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, Wow! Like, yo, hey, in Texas, this fucking really meant like last time. I know, shit, that's, you know crazy. that's crazy. Uh, but you're always learning. You always learn from yeah. people, and so I value everybody's opinion. You know what I mean? And everybody that can teach me something. Like when I was working in, you know, Atlanta, and uh, when I got the chance to work with Montel Jordan, he really schooled me to the game. And different artists that I meet, like I tell them off top, like, look, man, I know it might be weird, but I'm gonna just probably be working with you. We gonna do the session. I'm gonna ask you hella questions. Good, like, good. I just, I'm a, I'm, I'm a student, and I just listen and I learn and I remember things. So I'm, I'm like that with anybody, so you know. And you're hearing it here first, StudioLink.com. If you ain't fucking learning, yeah. you ain't doing shit. If yeah. you're standing still and you think right. you're the shit, exactly. that's when you're losing. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right. So check this out. We're going to get back into some motherfucking music. Let the hottest hood DJ in the fucking um, yeah, I heard about Who would that be? I heard about that be? <laughs> I mean, this one fucker, I found the fucking swap meet.